Hey guys, uh, today I wanted to talk about the Black Spindle. Uh, this gun really excels in PvE, but I wanted to talk about it from the PvP perspective today. Black Spindle's perks are a carbon copy of its predecessor, Black Hammer, from the Dark Below expansion. The White Nail perk allows people who are very precise with their shots to never have to reload until they run out of ammo. However, this perk doesn't really apply to PvP, as there is a timer on the shots, and if you don't hit them quick enough, the perk will not activate. It's pretty rare to get a triple kill in Crucible with a sniper, let alone all of them being precision shots. The last perk is Mulligan. This perk actually is a lot better than it used to be. It activates quite frequently after the 2.0 patch, and as you can see here, it actually activates twice back to back. Judging from the perks, I think it's safe to say that the Black Spindle was designed for bosses with large amounts of health and to be able to do massive amounts of DPS to them. So how does this weapon fare in the Crucible? Well, for starters, it does 181 damage per shot to the body and 452 damage per shot to the head. That's enough to kill pretty much anything in the Crucible if you can manage to land a headshot. That includes an active Sunbreaker. Now, Black Spindle is in the highest category impact of snipers, along with Effort Eat Spear, which makes it extremely easy to clean up kills with body shots if you happen to miss a headshot. The downside to this is that it has a very slow rate of fire, and there are only three rounds in the magazine. Overall though, if you're a fan of the Effort Eats type archetype of sniper rifle, you'll probably really enjoy using this in the Crucible. With all this being said, it is an exotic sniper, so you'd have to sacrifice using an exotic primary, or maybe even Truth, Thunderlord, or the Bolt Caster, if you prefer using those for PvP. Ultimately, I can sit here and say that I wouldn't recommend using it in the Crucible. In my opinion, there are other legendary alternatives that are just as good. I will say this though, it is extremely satisfying landing headshots with the Black Spindle. The sound of the gun firing in itself is awesome, and when you shoot the gun, you know that with every shot has a ton of power behind it. My advice, if you want to go into the Crucible to have fun and switch it up a little bit, go ahead and use the Spindle. If you want to be really competitive in the Crucible, use a Legendary Sniper and an Exotic Primary of some sort. Now that's just my opinion, I know some of you guys out there are very good with Black Spindle and will disagree, but for me, I usually perform better with my thousand yard stare. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, I'm just going to let the rest of these clips play out for you, and maybe you guys can decide if it's worth using the Crucible or not. Enjoy!